Good day, everyone. We are we are from the program stage one. My name is Mary Jacqueline Arthur. My name is Mika Jandi Luciano. And we are being sent in a research environment a study of the effect of alcohol on brush as an alternative to regular means of brush and its accessibility. Introduction. Topic. Using of alcohol on brush as an alternative to regular means of brush. As for the results in table, for table 1, profile of the respondents in terms of aller almond allergies. Table 1, frequency and percentage distribution of the respondents in terms of almond allergies. This is the two options that we need to ask. Yes, I have and no, I have it. The, the frequency of yes, I have is 1, so the percentage is 5%. And no, I haven't, it's 19 who answered and 95% of percentage. Table 1. Population and sample of respondents. For our section is STEMS, UMS, ABM, ICT, NHE. For STEM, the population have 168 for percentage 0 and sample is 0. We didn't interview a STEM section. For UMS, the population is 159 and the percentage is 20% and sample is 4. ABM, the population is 190 and the percentage is 20% same as the UMS and sample is 4. For ICT, 134 population and percentage is 10% and, we, and the sample is 2. NHE Population is 123, percentage is 50%, and half of the survey question sample is 10. Sample. For table number 2, sample distribution. 
insection stem we didn't interview so the total is zero for yums one section one is one section two is two and section three is one for a total of four abm section one we have one respondents and section two we don't have and section three we have three for ict section one only had one and section two had only one also there is no section three in ict for a total of two and he section one eight is the sample respondents and he2 we have 2 and also section 3 we don't have section 3 so 0 for a total of 10 for total of 20 for the questions respondents using of almond flour crust as an alternative to regular pizza crust in terms of use of almond flour we have 10 questions and this is the questions. 1. Do you know what is almond flour? 11 answered yes, 3 answered maybe, and 6 answered no. 2. Do you know the benefits of almond flour? For yes, we have 4, 8 maybe, and 8 for no. 3. Have you tried using almond flour? Zero for yes. Maybe didn't they use it? Maybe for six. No for fourteen. Four. Have you ever thought or considered using almond flour the pizza crust? One answer yes. Eleven answered maybe. And eight answered no. 5. Will you be willing to try pizza crust with almond flour? 8 answered yes, 12 answered maybe, and 0 for no. Do you know that almond flour is keto friendly? 1 answered yes, maybe answered 11, and 8 answered no. 7. Did you know that almond flour helps to reduce weight? 4. Answered yes. 10. Answered maybe. And no. Answered 6. 8. Do you know almond flour is healthy? 9. Answered yes. 9. Answered maybe. And 2. Answered no. 9. Do you know almond flour is rich in vitamin E and an other antioxidants? 7 answered yes, 8 answered maybe, and 5 answered no. 10. The last question. Will you consider using almond flour as an alternative to regular pizza crust? 10 answer yes. 10 answered maybe and 0 for no and that's for the results
We see in a tree. What methods or sampling technique did you employ and why did you choose? And what are your findings? Survey research questionnaire method is a quantitative method for collecting information from a pool of respondents by asking multiple surveys, questions, respondents, answers, of question of a design survey that survey makes a research used to improve their product or services. Survey research is an especially useful approach when a research aims to describe or explain features of a very large group or groups. Reporting your findings, what are the recommendations? What materials should you choose for future research? I must start that we an alternative to regular research process and it has many benefits. But what do you say? What do you say has a negative effect? Could you control too much? For future researchers, Try finding another card that can be used as an alternative to regular research process. This has no negative side effects, even if it is too much of too much. How can, you how can you research study if it is too practice? 
when you have something new to learn, you can tell it to others or get an idea for your own research. 7. What the origin or theoretical framework is to study based on? If it is based on your theoretical model is provided with the actual backbone of three parameters of evaluation. How would you relate your findings to And for the closing remarks or comments, for the closing remarks, I would like to thank that my teacher, our teacher, Ayin Ignacio, for giving us opportunity to, gi to give us a video oral defense. And I would like to thank my classmate, Jemeline Donaire, Daphne Marte, Chris Kriska, Jane Sarmento, to help us for this video and this is the name and the leader or the members prepared by group 10 12 h1 leader donaire mary jameline r and the members are luciano miko jandi marte daphne a n charmento chris kajane p and our teacher ma'am ayin ignacio and again, I would like to thank all of you to watch this video. Thank you.